The toolbar is composed of the most important tools that you're likely to use in the Shortcuts Allowed program. The top one here is known as the Selection Tool. This tool is used to select either individual or multiple objects on the mat. Once you have clicked an object on the mat, you'll notice a bounding box appears. It is this bounding box that enables you to move, scale, and rotate that selected object. The next tool in the menu is the Type Tool. This button looks a little different because it has a hidden feature or submenu. By holding your mouse button down, you are able to select between Regular Type Tool and Vertical Type Tool. Just select which one you desire and you're ready to type. Just click anywhere on the virtual mat and start typing. The next two tools are pretty self-explanatory. They are the Zoom In and Zoom Out tools. You select either one of these and you are able to increase or decrease the magnification of your mat. Finally, we have the Hand tool. Once you have selected the hand tool, you are able to click and drag on the mat. It acts as if you grab the mat with your hand and you are sliding it over to see what else is on the page.